Okay. So I got my team order today. Um, I know what is coming or what came. So let's see if I can just open them real quick. Um, let's get it down here in the camera view. I bought two of these, and the, uh, the reason why I'm doing this today is because my daughter's coming over, and one of these is for her. So <laughs> I needed to do this today. Um, I was hoping it would be the size that it is. That's good. I don't know if you can see this or not, but it'll hold her yarn. And the yarn goes through this little hole, and it comes out, and it keeps the ball inside the actual bowl itself. And I paid, it looks like I paid, um, $10.19 for these. I, had, I looked for these on Amazon, and it was twice that amount. So I really, and this right here, actually, I would have put my needles through it, or the my my knitting needles, but we'll see what she's going to use it hers for. I got two of those. Love you. <laughs> so I got these beads for my macrame. I don't know if the holes in these beads here will be um, big enough to do the crafts that I want to do them but I definitely will try it I mean I, I knew that when I ordered them that they may not be exactly what I wanted but that's why I ordered them I thought you know what I get my supplies from Amazon and I order them and these were so much cheaper um, I knew they were different sizes because I thought I could do some other different designs with the smaller ones so I'm gonna try to do so I will do something with them I just don't know what off the top of my head right now but I got 800 of the natural wood ones and that way I can paint them whatever color I want. And I got those for $8.48. Let's see here. Oh, I've been wanting this. So let me get this in here and cut this open. So I've been playing with um, um, air dry clay for some of my wooden, for some of my wood pieces. And I, upside down for you, um, I needed a lock and keys for some of the books that I was making. Um, I make paper stack books and paint them and, and antique them. So this will be a good, because I wanted to put a, a lock on the top of the key. I'll show this in another video. A lock and then hang the key down, dangle it down over the side of the book. So. Oh, look at this one. Now, these will definitely work with my um, macrame. And they were already painted. I don't know if you can see them. I'm going to open them up and you can see it. But they are black and white with black and white plaid and, and gray. So I've got the black and white ones. And I have used these before, especially at Christmas. I make um, wooden um, Christmas countdown calendars. And I make a little ring to hang over the number that you can move it from day to day so the kids know how many more days before Christmas, before Santa comes. So, and I got all of these, 200 of them with all the different colors, which will go a long way. It's $6.18. So, let's next thing out. Okay. Let's so I got these. So, I needed, um what I call smalls in my little in my little booth that I'm getting ready to open for inexpensive things that I can do and sell but decorations. And I picked up these. These were um, 12 of them in a, a thing for $8.48. Um, which is less expensive than what Walmart sells their little pieces for it. So I picked them up. I wanted to try it and see how they are. I'll do some crafts on that and show you what I'm talking about doing. Um, a lot of them will probably be Christmas stuff, um, but other holidays too. But I, on the smalls, I do a lot of Christmas stuff. There's this design and the little round. There's two of each, one of these, um, two of each one. Here is another design. That one's cute. These will be cute like on your door, like no soliciting sign going home. So I might do something like that. And then this square sign. And it comes with string. I'm not real sure, or jute. I'm not real sure I'll use their jute, but I might. I've gotten more jute upstairs, but we'll see. I'll have a video on how I get those done. So. OK, 
Okay, I bought these. <laughs> They're just kind of cute. Smaller than I was hoping for, but it's not like they were, um, like, misadvertisements. I mean, I knew how, how what size they were, but I was hoping that they would be a little bit bigger. But they are, if I can figure out how to do it. It goes, ah, oh, there it is. So they're just to hold my wood pieces, especially when I'm drying things. They're just little squares. And I got four of them. And each one of those was um, $1.98 a piece. I mean, what can you expect for $1.98, right? But it will hold my little crafts, just like these boards, if I were to glue them together. And you can just clamp it down and make it tight and hold, the, hold them together. And I can get in, see they're tight. Just like that. And I got four of those because I, I have a lot of projects that I got going on at the same time. So we'll see. <sighs> this is a pocket hole jig. And it's actually heavier than I thought it would be. And it's metal. I was afraid that it wouldn't be. I don't know if you know what a pocket hole jig is, but I'm putting two. Um, larger pieces of wood together. I like to use these because you can hide the, you can hide. Oh, it comes with the bits too. I don't know if you can see that those are the, the bits that come with it. And, oops. But when you put your drill through here, you make your holes down into your wood, and it, it hides your actual screws. So when you're working the wood, I'll use that quite a bit, but if I use it, I'll show you a video of me using it. I also uh, make Christmas ornaments quite a bit, but I've been also using the the, the balls and the deck, not making them Christmas, but just any everyday stuff. And so I started ordering my fabric from them, and it looks like they're fan. This is the red set. Um, this red set was two dollars and forty-eight cents, and this fabric right here, which I really liked, has a gold in it, and I have a gold. Um, fabric that I can use with the ornaments and it'll bring that gold out. But this is the red set and it comes with, I think they're nine by nine. They may be eight by eight by 11. I'm not real sure, but it's enough for me to make one Christmas ornament out of these contrasting fabrics. And this is the red set. I bought from them before I knew what I was getting when I ordered it, but I really like this red so I could add the gold with it. So, and let's see what this is. I don't know what this is. Excitement is building. Ah! <laughs> I do know what this is. Don't know how this works yet, but oh, I do see. So it holds two pieces. Let me get my boards back in here. Two boards. So it will make it at a 90 degree angle and it'll hold it for you. Just like that. And I got four of them. And it's pretty tight. So if you have a bigger, thicker piece of wood than what I've got here, you can hold it down and it'll hold them all in. So it'll hold it. Got a pretty tight squeeze there. But it'll hold a one by four and make it a, a, a square for you on the ends when you're nailing the nailing it in or screwing it in. It'll be square for you. And this is one of the things I bought. I was kind of excited about this because I do this all the time. So let me get this bag off here. <clears throat> As soon as I saw it, I was like, oh, what a, somebody's bright idea. So these are little triangles. And they hold your project while you're painting. So, because I have so much trouble holding on to, to pieces like this, painting it, and then trying to let it dry somewhere. And I ended up with, um, looks like there's a total of 16 of them. I paid $4.48 for them. So I could do four projects at once, let them sit there while it dries, go to another one, put it on there. So there's that. All right. That's this haul. I've got three more orders coming in from other stuff. 
that uh, so I'll try to make those I'm not really sponsored by Timu I will one day hopefully I like the videos to show you what I can do with the stuff that I order from them. I'm not really excited about opening a bag <laughs> but I will try my best to um, as I do the projects and I'm getting stuff from Timu then I can show you those videos and that's really what I want to do so thanks for watching see you next time